a new year, and for many, that means a fresh start and new opportunities to improve their lot in life. And even with a global economic crunch, there are still those who believe that now is the best time to begin building your own business. But where and how do you start? And of course, the trickier question, what kind of business should you choose given current economic conditions? Tonight, we'll narrow down these choices and start you on the right track as we talk to experts about the businesses that will be all the rage in 2009. I'm Bam Aquino, and this is Startup, your guide to creating, maintaining, and growing your business. Welcome back to Startup. If you're into online shopping, chances are you've heard of and participated in eBay and other online auctions. You also know that it's the best place to get one-of-a-kind and hard-to-find products in the most convenient way. We decided to explore this trend of online shopping by talking to three successful online entrepreneurs. Watch this and you may get a few ideas of your own. It's been said that in every crisis, there's an opportunity. Today, when doing business in traditional ways is all the more difficult because of the global economic crisis, experts say that startup entrepreneurs turn to the cheaper and effective concept of online retailing. The wonder of the internet is that you can have an instant business without the hassle of huge overhead costs. Two young entrepreneurs, Jennifer Horn and Gail Go, are harnessing the power of the web to sell their funky laptop sleeves. We decided to go with laptop sleeves because we were trying to assess what was saturated in the market. And at the time that we first came out, laptop sleeves were not so prevalent. And if ever you didn't see any laptop sleeves, they were usually just plain, plain in color and drab. So we decided to come up with something funkier for more creative and fun people. Punch Drunk Panda Laptop Sleeves started out as a way for two friends to show their creative side as well as to earn a little extra income. Gail and Jennifer still maintain their full-time jobs because they only sell their products on Multiply. Managing the business actually is time-consuming. We usually just go online once once or twice a day, check orders, and then process everything. It's around three hours per day as compared to a full nine-hour job. They even went online to research on the marketability and saleability of the sleeves. For the research, we just did doctor research, YMing our friends, what they would prefer, our office mates. We'd ask our friends what did they look for for their laptops, like did they use skins or bags or sleeves, and what are their thoughts on sleeves. And when we settled on the sleeves, we would look at different sleeves online and in, sh in stores, like in Apple stores or whatever computer shops were selling sleeves. We'd look at their designs and we, we were trying to see how we could improve on the existing designs in the market. Look out for even funkier designs from these two ladies as they're in the process of developing a line of graphic design printed sleeves. Graphic design has kind of been an interest for us and um, we can actually see that a lot of people would be interested in such, such designs. Some may consider online retailing risky, especially those who think the local market isn't all that internet savvy. But our featured startups swear by the power of the web as a marketplace for just about anything a customer would want or need. You just have to take small steps, small but calculated steps. And then if, if you're scared of risking too much, just start with something small first and then build it up from there. 